The state's drug treatment and recovery community is in mourning this weekend following the death of a young mother whose struggle led to the founding of a treatment facility in Rochester specifically for pregnant women. Abby Lazat touched so many lives and advocates say her legacy will live on. Her struggle with opioid addiction sparked the founding of Hope on Haven Hill in Rochester, a treatment facility for expectant mothers. Carrie and Colleen loved me until I could love myself. This weekend, Hope on Haven Hill announced the tragic news of Abby Lazat's death. A statement on its website says, quote, The loss of Abby Lazat has left us utterly heartbroken. Abby will always be our inspiration and her light will live in the dreams and aspirations of all who pass through our doors. Abby was um, a real champion and a real warrior, but also very honest about her own struggles. Tim Rourke, chairman of the Governor's Commission on Alcohol and Drug Abuse, says Abby's willingness to step forward and speak out made a difference, shining a spotlight on those struggling to break free from the grip of opioid addiction. I think this is, you know, a moment to grieve, but also to continue to be um, steadfast, recognizing that we're in it for the long haul um, in continuing to build on um, the kind of vision that she had for how people needed to be treated with this disorder. Today, Senator Maggie Hassan also offered her condolences. My heart just goes out to Abby's family and friends. She was a woman who really, really was working so hard to overcome this illness. Abby Lazat leaves behind her son, Parker, who was six months old in this video, but is now almost three. And Abby's cause of death has still not yet been made public.